Yeah. Come, you. Yeah, come. I filmed the video. Welcome to my channel. I am Coco the Natural or Nicole and this is my first YouTube video. Yay! I am super duper excited to be starting my YouTube and that this is my first video and I am so blessed to be able to pair with a company for my first video y'all. This is long overdue and I just wanted to really share these bomb results that I got using the Pidana collection. And I am just loving the moisture, the shine y'all, that it is giving my hair. Um, I do do my flat twist a little bit differently. Make sure you guys tune in. I will be posting every Monday and um, yes, yeah, so we will hop into the video. I'm gonna go ahead and stop talking. Please like, comment, and subscribe down below and let your girl know if you love these results. And until next time, see y'all later. Peace. So I'm gonna start by using the Padana Collections Marula and Kapuka. 3-in-1 Intensive Moisturizer, uh, following their Luscious Locks Herbal Silk Hair Oil. It has Omega-3, 6, and 9 um, acids, as well as um, Vitamin E oil. Um, it's definitely non-greasy. And then I'm going to go ahead and follow up with a sealant. Uh, this is Badana Collection's Maru, Maru, and Black Castor Oil Moisturized Seal Cream. I'm just um, going to be starting off with uh, parting in the front. I'm just going to go ahead and do um, small to medium sections, just working my way down. This is basically the LOC method that I'm using. I'm just really working that product in from roots to ends and then going in and just flat twisting from top to bottom. And here you just see me still flat twisting. This was originally supposed to be a, a talk through video, but I decided to just do a voiceover because, yeah, my computer was not picking up my voice. I'm very soft spoken, but I just want to continue to do that all the way through and work that product to the ends because your ends are the oldest part of your hair. So you just want to make sure they're well moisturized and also when we're unraveling in the morning, you don't want any fuzz or frizziness and that is me sneezing. <laughs> but you just want to keep it going um, and yeah, just keep going all the way to the end. And y'all, I'm really showing y'all here how juicy those twists are. Like, they're so juicy. Like, I have not had my hair this juicy in a long time. For the winter, I've really been focusing on um, manageability as well as long-lasting styles. But what I've been finding is using gels and using foams have really been drying my hair out. Um, I really love these products in the sense that they're very lightweight so like even in the summer I won't have like an oily neck um, <laughs> which everyone I know hates they it sucks to have an oil neck in the freaking summer so I really like the fact that these like I said are very lightweight even though I'm using three products And here you see me just continuing that twist down 
and I was so happy with the shine that I started to dance and Lord knows there was no music on um, but you just want to keep that LOC method going um, if you see I was trying to explain here that there are some ends of my hair that are a little shorter especially in the back because I thought I had some heat damage uh, the last time that I straightened my hair um, so it is cut almost in a layer um, I probably will not straighten my hair again until I know it's in optimum health but I'm just like I said following on along um, doing that LOC method to make sure I get that optimum moisture because we need that like I just cannot go without it any longer um, like I said, I usually start my two strand twist with a regular twist, or excuse me, flat twist with a regular twist in the beginning and then just following that all the way down, adding some product through the ends just to get them really hydrated. And here you're just seeing me just secure those ends and then crisscrossing the ends and applying a bobby pin. Now I haven't really seen too many people doing this but I know from my hair if I just try to go to sleep on my hair just out and about in a bonnet it will not. I repeat it will not stay. So this is the end result um, of crisscrossing them. Here I am just securing my twist with my black satin scarf that I picked up from my favorite store, the Beauty Sub Black. And I'm just going ahead and I'm going to just tie it uh, once around the front and then get it from, I just re-pierced my top ear myself so I was just removing that from my top ear. Going ahead and secure that and just tuck it in and go to bed girl. Go to bed. Ooh. Here I am the next morning and I am bright and refreshed um, on my way to work so I literally had like 20 minutes to get ready but I'm just taking down my twist and making sure that all those bobby pins are out of my head. I don't know how many times I've gone out and I've found a bobby pin in my head hours later. <laughs> I'm sure other naturals know the struggle because it really is a struggle. So yeah, I'm just going ahead checking and making sure I'm getting all of those out of my head. Then I'm going to grab some of my Pudana Collections Luscious Lux Herbal Silk Hair Oil with Argan Oil and the Omega 3, 6, and 9 that I mentioned earlier in the video. And guys, just look at that definition. I was too excited. Um, and yeah, I'm just taking those out. I'm really starting at the base of my head. I do not, I repeat, do not detangle from ends to the root of my hair. I just think that creates um, unnecessary frizz. Um, and that's something that we don't want. But yeah, I'm just going around my head and just making sure that I am taking them out um, little by little and not getting any, like I said, unnecessary frizz. Um, I will begin to separate them. I did notice that my hair was a little bit straight at the end, but I think that's just from pulling and also doing my hair um, very dry. Typically I will do these like really wet, but I knew I had to go to work the next day so I did not need a wet style because wet styles equal frizz. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and continue to take this out and then I will fluff and separate. And here I am just fluffing my hair out with my fingers. I'm not really one for day one hair so you're going to see me probably playing around with it a lot. I love my hair to be very very big um, and yeah I'd rather also pull my hair back so all I am doing right now is taking my 24 hour edge tamer by Eben New York just to secure that twist um, in those edges up. I also think that putting my hair back like this gives my um, styles a lot of height in the front which I love. I'm not really one, like I said, for day one hair, so I just make sure that I have a little bit of styling when I do have day one. 
Um, sometimes I will walk around day one with my hair pulled up in like a pineapple just to give it that height that I'm looking for for the next day. But yeah, I'm just taking a bobby pin and securing those twists down so that they locked all day. But yeah, y'all, these are the finished results. My hair is very bouncy. It's movable. I have a lot of shine and it is moisturized. So definitely check out Pidana Collection and give them a try. And until the next time, y'all, peace and love. Bye.